Do you want to see him? Georgie? She spoke in the tiniest of voices and I followed my mother into a small, drably lit room. Nothing much in the way of furniture, a couple of wooden chairs. Not much else to distract from the dry grey corpse underneath a spotless sheet. I can describe it now, but at the time I didn't know what I was looking at. Why had my mother brought me in here to view the remains of this tiny husk of a man? When we were supposed to be burying my grandfather. I think we stood there for a bit. What are you supposed to do? It wasn't until several years after the funeral that it suddenly occurred to me that what had been lying in that room had also been lying in the box in the aisle of the church, and I'd watched that box being buried in the dirt outside. There'd been a hole in my memory of that day as deep as the grave. 